Hi students. So we completed the unit production of food from plants in last class. In today's class, we are going to discuss ninth unit that is production of food from animals. Production of food from animals. Today, I am going to give an introduction class of this ninth unit. Production of food from animals. So plants is a very very important for the food materials for us. We are not only depending on the plants. If we are depending on the plants, so it will not fulfill the need of the food food materials for the human beings because there are millions of poor of peoples is there in the world. If all everybody is vegetarian. how it is sufficient food materials for all the human beings it's not sufficient that's why we also depending on the plants and as well as we are depending on the animals for the food materials then only there is a balance otherwise everybody is vegetarians in few days we are going to collapse all the vegetarians on the earth that's why we need both Vegetables, we need plants, and we also need as well as animals also. So simultaneously, we need both food materials. Today we will discuss production of food from the animals. So there are so many animals is there in the entire universe. Billions of animals is there, but there are some. domestic animals is the domesticated animals domesticated is nothing but they live in our surrounding with us including human beings animals also live with us for example can you say some examples of animals domesticated animals the animals live in our homes like cat cat is live in our home Our houses, dog, dog also live in our houses, but in some people's day, how uh, they some rabbits, pig also. You can see the pigs, some like cows, buffaloes, horses, donkeys. As some animals are domesticated animals, but the human human beings are. not domesticated all the animals what is the reason because there are some cruel animals as well if you domesticated them we can't survive for example tiger if you take lion tiger elephant or oh, how much shelter is required for the elephant so it's a huge shelter is required for the elephant it's danger okay sare car bed is that it will destroy sometimes Like elephants will become its angry. It will beat somebody. Like oh, it will dig it. Like it's a danger. Elephants, lions, such cruel animals. We can't domesticate them. So only few animals are domesticated. But but we can see such type of animals in zoo park. So there is separate bones is there. So animals also very 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 important for the food materials. Not only food materials, we are using for other purpose also animals, like plowing the how plowing the fields, sowing the seeds, for carrying the goods, etc. Okay. So in in olden days, kings they used to horses for riding to go for wars. They used riding horses, elephants. There are so many uses as that, like some birds they used for the messages to carry the letters from one place to the other place. So there are so many uses was there, but nowadays so this countries become very technically. We are having the computers, we are having the mobile phones, internets, okay, etc., etc., etc. So. 
Then what is animal husbandry? It is important. Animal husbandry. So it is important. In, in the production of food from the animals. Animal husbandry is very, very important for two months. Providing food. Providing food. Providing shelter. And the protection. Providing food. Providing shelter. And protection. Breeding of animals. Breeding of animal he is called as animal husbandry. So there are so many uses is there for the animals. We are getting milk, curd, ghee, and we are getting from the seed we are getting wool, like cloths we are preparing from the like hens we are getting. Eggs, we are getting chicken, mutton. So there are so many useful is there. So we are getting food from the animals, but we have to do favor of the animals, providing food materials, providing proper food materials to the animals. Then only they will give proper meal, giving shelter to the animals. They can't survive like outside. So. If you go to purchase a buffalo, in last few days back we saw that buffalo was there. Ten crores buffalo was there. Ten crores. Dunnapur. Like goats, we can see. Goats are called in Stamil. Dunnapur. Ten crores. How much beautiful that buffalo was there. Dunnapur, I pay for the dosia. So, like bullock carts, one lakh. Mammal buffaloes, 1 lakh, 2 lakh, 3 lakhs, per hour. But we have to provide shelter then. So in villages, a separate shelter is there. Chinna Sedeshi, protection from the sunlight, protection from the like rain, protection from the like wind. There is a separate shelter we have to provide them. And protection. We have to protect so many diseases also occur to these animals. So it is far more responsibility to take protection of the animals. Like cleaning, like bathing, uh, removing urines, like uh, removing the waste, grasses, dung, the clean shed of the nature, and breeding also. So their number, their population will be increased by the breeding. So, insectal reproduction, we will discuss about this breeding. So, this is about animal husbandry. Animal husbandry is nothing but providing of food materials, providing of shelter, protection, breeding of animals called as animal husbandry. These animals domesticated so many years back ago, BCs, before Christ, these animals started domesticated. Some animals are Domesticated name of the animals. And the period of domesticated. Domesticated. Period of domesticated. For example, take dog. When dog was domesticated around 30,000 to 7,000 BC. Around 30,000 to 7,000 BC, this dog was domesticated. And see, very calm animals, 11,000 BC. To 9000 BC. Pig, you can see so many 
pigs. There are two different types of pigs. One is a domesticated pig, another you can see in the fields. Adavipandi. So, that is a different. That is dangerous than this pig. So, this pig is domesticated around 9000 BC. And goat. This goat domesticated around 8000 BC. These animals are domesticated in the BC, not in any. So 30,000 years back. So dog domesticated. 11,000 to 9,000 years see domesticated. 9,000 BC domesticated. 8,000 BC there was already goat was there according to science. So this is about the animals are domesticated before pieces not in AD. So it is very very important for the human beings. It's giving food materials. So not only we are depending on the food materials for other purpose also. For riding, for field purpose, for agriculture purpose and we are depending on this animals. Next one is cattle rain. What is cattle rearing? What is cattle rearing? Pasula kapari, gorilla kapari. So in villages we can see this cattle rearing. There are many people who are there in olden days. They go for the cattle rearing. So these people taking care of the animals. So the cat, the person, the one who appointed for a cattle rearing, the person one who appointed for a cattle rearing, the he is paid by them. There are so many owners who are there. Like for example, there are ten people they have so many cattle, but one person appointed for the cattle rearing, but all the ten owners has to pay the money for the cattle rails. For example, if they have 10 cattle, they have to pay one cattle 500 rupees, 1000 rupees for year. For 10 cattle, they have to pay 1000, 10,000 rupees. Like, the person has to appoint it for the railing of the cattle. They gather all the cattle and he will go to the forest. For morning at 8 o'clock or 9 o'clock, we will go, we will take the lunch box also. Until the 9, this cat is going to start eat the grass in the surrounding areas, in the forest where the plenty of grass is there. A person who is in the forest, he 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 is in the Again, he has to return. In the evening at 5 o'clock or 6 o'clock. So, this cattle railer, we should be taking care of the animals. So, animals are taking care of this because in the forest there are so many other animals also there. Like foxes, lions will be attacked, sometimes tigers will be attacked. He has to protect themselves. So, not only taking care, providing food materials, shelter protection, breeding of the animals. So, that boy has to appoint it for the rearing of the animals. So, he will get a salary for monthly or yearly. But nowadays, there are no persons they are going for the cattle rearing. Everybody became very fashion. So, many people they are going to the schools. Okay? Everybody has smartphones in their hands. They are looking what's our Facebook. They are not going for the cattle. That's why the animals number started decreasing. In old days there are plenty of in one, one house at least five to six animals was there, but nowadays there is no animals. No goats, not all goats, even hens also not there. Hens also not there. So what happened just technically we are 
developing. So that's why nobody is available for the cattle or raiding. And so the person has to take care of the animals. Health also very very important. Like human beings, this animals also affected with the diseases. Like gali kundu, gali kundu disease affected with the mouth and food. Not only this gali, natala vadi, natala vadi. There are so many some of skin diseases. Likely the neck, the mouth, in the food, we can see this. This natala vadi, gali kundu disease. These are diseases. When diseases occur to the animals, so the, the the person, the farmer has to take the animals, and they will go for the veterinary hospital. Veterinary hospital is specific, specifically for the animals. Animal doctor, veterinary doctor. So, so many nowadays we have so much demand for the veterinary. Doctors, very less doctors in that. They are very demanding villages. Veterinary hospital is nothing but animal hospital is called as veterinary hospitals. This is about production of food from the animals. Okay, today we discuss what is animal husbandry and what is the domesticated animals in which year animals domesticated. What is cattle breeding? One person is appointed for the cattle rearing. The owner should be paid money for the cattle rearers. He should be paid. He will provide the food materials. They will go for the forest from morning to evening. The cattle start eating the grass. Then they will come evening. So they have to take care about the animals, of their health, everything. So the animals also affected with the diseases like gali kundu, like nanchala vadi. Will be affected with the mouth and the food. They have to go for the veterinary hospital for the productions. They will give injections. So medicines also available for this animals. This is about today introduction of the production of food from the animals. Today homework. Okay, you have to write what is animal husbandry. Right? What is animal husbandry? And name of the animals. Period of domesticated. Name of the animal. Period of domesticated. So, cattle rearing. What is cattle rearing? You have to write. I have to write two diseases also. Diseases. Gali kuntu nathala vani. Okay? I mean, it was discussed in the next time. Thank you, students.